A local developer is breathing new life to a space in Warren that's been sitting empty since the 70s. Trumbull County reporter Nadine Grimley talked with city officials today about what the sale of the Robbins Theater means to downtown Warren. She's in the newsroom with more on that story tonight. Well, Dave, the city of Warren has seen a lot of revitalization over the past few years, but the Robbins Theater has always been a big hole on a very busy street, East Market Street, leading right downtown Warren. But city officials hope that'll soon change. It's this vacant space on a busy street leading to the heart of Warren that used to be the Robbins Theater. It's been idle since it closed in the 70s, but is now roped off with caution tape a sign that new life is coming to this empty front. The city's thrilled about it. According to the Trumbull County Auditor's website, Mark Marvin's Downtown Development Group, LLC, bought the building last week for $375,000. I think he saw the potential for it um, as an entertainment venue, as a hub in the downtown, and primarily as a draw in the downtown. The Robbins Project announced the sale and says Marvin intends to restore the theater and have Sunrise Entertainment, the company who runs River Rock at the Amp each summer, manage it. We look forward to what they're going to bring to the venue. Safety Service Director Enzo Canalamesa says this will only help attract people downtown. Where the entertainment dollar goes, so goes restaurant dollars, um, bar dollars, tourism dollars. So it, it's part of a large revitalization and development plan. Now we are expecting to learn more about those development plans, plus get a tour of the space at a press conference scheduled for February 6th. Live in the newsroom tonight, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.